In exactly 10 minutes, a 50 megaton nuclear warhead is going to hit New York City. I am the leader of the Soviet Union in 1962, and I guess it's my job to call the US president. Besides that, I have no idea what this game is about. I'm going into this completely blind. You guys have been telling me to try it out. Let's see. Obviously, the height of the Cold War. You were the chairman of the USSR around that time of the Cuban Missile Crisis. So unfortunately, a uh, technical failure caused this 50 megaton nuclear warhead to come at us. Uh, or to come at them. I guess we have to just say, hey, sorry, bro. <laughs> Thanks to breakthroughs in Soviet uh, aviation, your military advisor estimates a delivery in 10 minutes. So I guess... Oh, gosh. I'm like... Uh, that was kind of freaky. I don't even know what I'm supposed to... Okay. Uh, your last hope at preventing Armageddon is to get the U.S. Army to intercept the plane. Time to call the president. This is freaking me out already. Uh, okay. Hello? Do I have to know? Oh, I think it's ringing. You should probably pick up, please. <laughs> we just wasted 15 seconds. Hi, you have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Thank you for your call. Are you calling about an urgent matter? And would you like a direct line with the president? Yes. Press 1. Yes. In order for us to connect you to the president, we will need a verification code. No way. Please enter your six-digit identification code and close with pound. I don't know what my six-digit... Uh, one, two, three, four, In five, order for us to six, connect you to the pound. One, two, three, four, five, six. That was not the right code, or you may not have the clearance to contact the president. I am the U.S. Please enter your Washington Moscow hotline verification code again and close with pound. I, I, I don't know what it is. Uh... Did we have one at this time? No, 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 please. That was not the right code. Would you like to try again? Press one. Wait, maybe no. <laughs> In order for us to connect you to the president, we will need a verification code. I wasn't given this please code enter before. enter your six digit identification code and close with pound. Oh, why, why do I feel like maybe I do know this number? In order for us to connect you to the president, we will need a ver verification code. Um. There is a number that, that I know. That was not the right code, or you may not have the clearance to contact the president. But I don't think it's for this. It's 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 for like it's the nuclear launch that codes. That was not the right code, or you may not have the clearance to contact the president. I, d I don't I don't I don't know what to do. What if I don't sit, do anything? That was not the right code, or you may not have the clearance to contact the president. Do you have to Google this? Would you like to try again? No. Press one. No. Ah, uh, here if we go. If you would like to return to the main menu, press two. Okay, I wasted. Four and a half minutes. Hi, you have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Oh, it's over. Thank you for your call. It's over Europe. Are you calling about an urgent matter? And would you like a direct line with the president? Okay, well, we know that we can't. Press one. No. If your matter is less urgent and you would like to speak to a representative, press two. Uh, for I... other matters, press three. We value your call. I guess two. A representative two. will speak with you shortly. Uh... You are 14th in line. <laughs> Expected wait time is. 34 minutes. Okay, well, at least we got some jams going on. The problem is they're going to see this when they see it in the air and then launch their own code, so we're dead. Can, uh, how do I just hang up? C can we can we hang up? I can't. This cannot be the last music I hear before we die. Our wait times are unusually high right now. No, no, it no. It might be best to try again at another time. Okay. Would you like to continue waiting? No. Press 1. If you would like to go back to the main menu, press 2. Let's go back. It's got to be somewhere in here. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Four minutes. Are you calling about an urgent matter? And would you like a direct line with the president? It's almost midway through the Atlantic. Press one. No. If your matter is less urgent and you would like to speak to a representative, press two. Uh, no. For other matters, press three. Is there a nuke? We launched a nuke accidentally uh, at New York. If you're calling about renewing trade accords with the White House, press one. <laughs> if you're calling about our nuclear program, press two. <laughs> Maybe? If you're calling about applying for a Washington Moscow hotline verification code or oh. getting a reminder for your verification code, press 3. To I apply for Washington Moscow hotline verification code, press 1. No. For a reminder of your verification code, press 2. Maybe? Do I have to listen to all the options? Okay, 2. Please enter your three-digit reminder key and close oh with pound my. to get a reminder for your verification code. Oh, no. How, do you do how did you do this? Please enter your three... That was not the right code. Uh. Would you like to try again? No. Press 1. Give me the other one. To return to the main menu, press 2. No. All right. 
I think I remember Hi. this. You have reached the United States, Washington, Moscow. Okay, three. If you're calling about renewing trade accords with the White House, press one. It can't be that. If you're calling about our nuclear program, press two. Could it be two? If you're calling about applying for a Washington, Moscow hotline verification code, or uh, would it be two threes? To apply for Washington, Moscow hotline verification code, press one. Yeah. For a reminder of your verification code, press. Yeah, one. Wait, what well, we're applying? You're just gonna to give me an email in six weeks. Code, we need to know if you are a low ranking or high ranking official. Oh no. If you are low ranking, press one. If you are high ranking, press two. I'm the president of the USSR. I would, I would what assume. What is your function? If you are head of defense, press one. If you are head of international relations, press two. Is there a USSR president? If you are president, king, or chairman <laughs> of your nation, press three. Okay, we have two minutes. In order to grant you a Washington Moscow hotline verification code, I'm have to write we this need stuff to confirm down, you okay. are not a robot. Oh no. Please type the following code, one, four, six, two, uh -huh. and close with the pound key. One, four, six, two, pound. Thank you for applying for a Washington Moscow hotline verification four, code. Six, Your code two. is four, four, five. <laughs> Seven, eight, four, four, five, three. Seven, to get a reminder eight, of your code, three. use your reminder key, which is one, three, three. <laughs> to return to the main menu, one, press three, zero. three, one, three, three, one. Pounds. Give me the. Thank you for applying for a Washington Moscow hotline no! verification code. Your oh. code is four. No, 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 no. Go seven, into the main menu. Eight, three. To get a reminder of your code. No. Use your reminder key, which is one. We have one three, minute. Three. I have it. I have to it. Return to the main menu. Press zero. Zero. That's evil. Okay, Hi. one. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Uh, it's. Thank you for your call. Are you calling about an urgent matter, and would you like a direct line with the president? Yes, I have the number. In order for us to connect you to the president, please. You will need a verification. Code. I have it. Please enter your six-digit identification code and close with pound. Okay, it's four four five. Seven, eight, three pounds. Thank you for inputting your verification code. Welcome back, Chairman Lenkoff. We will now redirect you to the president. <laughs> Please wait. No, no. <laughs> please, please, John F. Kennedy, pick it up. You have 10 seconds. It's not even going to be enough. To... JFK, please. He's he's in Dallas, isn't he? Unfortunately, he's... the president is out of office at this time. That's evil. That that is evil. Your phone menu navigation was too slow. That is not how I expect to play this game. <sighs> Let's try again. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Thank you for your call. Please tell me the code Are is not changed. Are you calling about an urgent matter and would you like a direct line with the president? Please tell me the code is not changed. Please In tell me. In order for us to connect you to the president, we will need a verification code. Please enter your six digit identification code and close with pound. Four, four, five, seven, eight, three, pound. Thank you for inputting your verification code. Welcome back, Chairman Lenkoff. Okay. Well, let's we see. We will now redirect you to the president. Please Don't wait. So, so we know he's not in office. I already killed New York once. That'd be embarrassing if, if it happens again. The music makes it so much better. The dire situation. Why can't we just shoot it down ourselves? We'll shoot it down over the Atlantic. Unfortunately, the president Atlantic. is out of office at this time. Would you like to book an appointment? Press one. I can't is there this. an emergency that cannot wait? Yes. Press two. Now let's wait. Wait for all the options. Okay. Understood. We are dedicated to helping you out with your emergency. I can talk to literally- can you tell us more about what type of emergency you're experiencing? <laughs> Is the nature of your emergency economic? Is the nature of your emergency related to nuclear war? Yes. Press 2. Yes. I just want to make sure there's not a third option. We are to hear you are experiencing an emergency regarding nuclear war, and we take your call very seriously. <laughs> to help us understand the problem, can you tell us if your emergency endangers U.S. soil or not? If yes, press 1. If it doesn't, press 2. I would say yes. It's New York Nuclear City. Nuclear emergencies that threaten U.S. territory is a very important issue. Is it possible that you may have accidentally targeted the United States and need help with intercepting a missile? Yes. Yes. If yes, press 1. That's exactly what we need. If this is not the case and you wish to return to the main menu, press 2. Ooh. I imagine. 
going Did all the you way know back. you can order a special interception military mission from this menu? Oh. In order to do so, we need the military special permission code that aligns with the type of ballistic missile. I don't... If you have a code ready, press 1. I don't know! If not, press 2 to return to the main menu. Oh! I don't have a code! Please enter the four-digit military special permission code to engage an interception mission, then it's... close with the pound key. It's four digits? I only have two codes. I have 133. Three. That code is not a military special permission code, or you are not qualified to request it. Uh, okay, Please I'm, check again let, if you are inputting the right code. Let me try. To try again, press 1. 1. Let me try my hotline. 1. 4. Please enter the 4, four five, digit military special seven, eight, permission three code. Pound, please. That code is not a military special permission code, or you are not qualified to request it. I Please literally, check again if you are inputting the right code. To try again, press 1. To return to the main menu. Okay, we, uh, please don't tell me you have to go all the way back. Not all the way back. Hi. You have reached the United States Washington oh. Moscow hotline. Oh. Thank you for your call. Okay. Are you calling about an urgent matter? And would you like a direct line with the president? Oh, I do have to go press all the way one. back. I'm going to try to book an appointment. Well, we need to know what kind of ballistic. Maybe I'll go into. Well, let's go one first. Let's go one. I got five minutes before. To I've already died. Please enter a date and time. To do this, use the format month. Day, hours, minutes. Then close with pound. How about we do um four? To book an appointment. Twenty. Please enter a date and time. Nineteen sixty-two. This, thank you for booking your appointment. On behalf of the United States, we just, value our international relations and communications. They're just gonna. They're just gonna. To go up back to the main menu, press one. Hi. States, I hate everything Washington, about Moscow this. Hotline. Would you like to book an appointment? No. Is there an emergency? Yes. We should have the voice commands. Understood. No, yes. We are dedicated they didn't to have that in 1962. Your Is the nature of your emergency economic? Press 1. I just wonder if there's Is a reason the for me to do 1. Is the nature of your emergency one. related to nuclear war? Press 2. I think it still needs to be 2. We are very concerned to hear you are experiencing an emergency regarding nuclear war, and we take your call very seriously. To help us understand the problem, can you tell us if your emergency endangers U.S. soil or not? What if, if yes, press 1. Maybe here I should say... If it doesn't, press 2. 2. Let's we just see what they say. We are very sorry to hear that. Unfortunately, nuclear emergencies not pertaining to U.S. territory is outside our responsibility. I mean, we offer our condolences what if it was in Europe? With this issue. And they don't care. If you would like to return to the main menu, press zero. No, no. Give me other options. Give me other options. Hi. Is the nature of your emergency economic? It can't be that, is right? Is the nature of your emergency related to nuclear? Is it possible that you may have accidentally targeted the United States and need help with intercepting a missile? What if I say no here? If yes, press 1. If this is not the case and you wish to return oh. to the main menu, Whew. press 2. Don't want to say no there. Did you know you can order a special interception military mission from this menu? In order to do so, we need the military special permission code that aligns with the type of ballistic missile. Where? If you have a code ready, press 1. If not, press 2 to return to the main menu. Where would that be? Where is it? Hi. I just want to know. Thank you for your call. Four, four five. Can Are I just you skip this? About an urgent oh, I thought. If you're calling about renewing trade accords with the White House, press one. If you're calling about our nuclear program, press two. What is that? It did seem like I got a different. Would you like to know more about U.S. global relations? Press 2. I just need to figure out what ballistic missile. We understand tensions between our nations are high right now, but we believe effective and fast communication is prime to helping our relationship. To know more about communication, press 1. I guess. To know more about conflict prevention, press 2. Oh, conflict prevention... Two. Preventing conflict is key to maintaining the peace so many of our proud citizens enjoy. To know more about our preventative measures, press 1. To know more about protocol in case of an unlikely emergency, press 2. Maybe 2. In the unlikely event of a catastrophic event, such as an accidental launch of a nuclear ballistic missile, you may be able to help by calling the president. To learn how to call the president, press 1. To know what no. to do in the absence of the president, yes. press 2. Okay, in okay. the unfortunate circumstance that the president is not reachable at the time of an emergency, you can order an emergency interception through this menu. To do so, oh. return to the main menu and select nuclear programs under other matters to learn more about interception. Nuclear programs under... If you're calling about our nuclear program, press 2. I think it's that. Oh, I think they... The United States prides itself on its advanced nuclear technology. They take you on a... To learn more about how nuclear weapons prevent war, 
press 1. To learn more about the types of weapons the United States may use in relation to thermonuclear warfare, press 2. Uh... Please select a type of weapon which you would like to know more about. Press 1 for offensive weapons such as intercontinental ballistic missiles. Okay, yes. Press 2 to know more about defensive weapons such as interception planes. Oh, we need to know about our ballistic missile, I offensive think. Offensive weapons are used to strike tactical target over world spanning distances. Defensive weapons include jet fighters that are designed specifically to take down a moving ballistic missile. Did you know? You can order emergency military operations such as the interception of an accidental nuclear missile from this menu. You. To do so, you need to have a military special permission code that consists of two numbers based on speed of the missile and two numbers based on the best interception method. To know more about speed, press 1. To know more about the type of interception method, press 2. I guess if your one. ballistic missile is slow moving, press 1. If your ballistic missile is fast moving and can cross thousands of miles in minutes, press 2. Yeah, I think it can... I think it does that. Fast moving ballistic missiles have a military special permission code that starts with four zero. Now we need the other one. If your ballistic four, zero. missile is sent from the northern hemisphere, it requires an X form interception method. For more about this method, press one. If it is a southern hemisphere missile, it requires Y form interception. Or northern In that hemisphere. Case, press two. Come X form on. ballistic no. interception methods have a military special permission code that ends with the digits eight one. Mm. To learn more about ballistic speeds, press one. I already have it. Hi. Okay. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Four minutes. Thank you for your call. In order for us to connect you to the president. Four, four, five, seven, eight, three. Pipe. I'm so glad I have this pen on me and a piece of paper. I had no idea I was going to need this. And we have to we wait 15 will now seconds here. To the president. Please I wait. have the code. Now, what else are you going to want me to do once I answer this code? It's two. Is there an emergency that cannot wait? It's two, two, one, one to get through the menu, but I don't think I can Understood. go. Understood. We are dedicated to helping you out with your emergency. I don't think that's going to give me anything that path down the economic we part. We are very concerned to hear you are experiencing an emergency regarding nuclear war, and we take your call very seriously. I'm going to skip. I think I got it. Is it possible that you may have accidentally targeted the United States What's the other and option need help here? with intercepting a missile? Yes. If yes, press 1. If this is not the case, and you wish to return to the main menu. Okay, it's definitely 1 there. Okay. Did you know you can order a special interception yes. military mission from this menu? Please don't give me more or In order to do so, we need the military special cases. permission. If you have a code ready, press 1. Please enter the four-digit military special Thank permission God code digits. to engage an interception mission, then close with the pound key. 4081 pounds. The code you entered is for intercepting a fast-moving missile with an X-form interception method. Yes. Are you sure you want to continue? Yes. Press 1. Please. 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 Are you absolutely sure? Yes! Yes. Remember, this action can only be performed once. Yes. Press one if you are absolutely sure. What's two? Press two if you'd like to return to the main menu. Oh, I hate you. Understood. We will send out a special military interception operation right away. Did I mess it up though? Thank you for your cooperation. Oh my goodness, I just didn't want any more. Ugh, that was evil. <laughs> Master phone menus. I didn't know if I had the right order of numbers. I didn't know if it was it was four zero eight one. I didn't know if it was eight one four zero. What's interesting is there really was a hotline that came at the wake of October nineteen sixty two during the Cuban Missile Crisis. It actually was also a red telephone. So obviously the world would have uh, been destroyed. I needed thirty minutes, but um, yeah, ten minutes wasn't enough. And big thanks to my patrons. Drew, I forgot to kidnap you. Next date is March nineteenth, twenty twenty three. At 6 boy, do PM. I love Arby's. Drew's Eritrean grandma. Portugal is not Drew's Balkans. Argentina. Twenty dollars is a lot. Drew. A fat Norwalk. Brighton is the Caleb best. Demetrius 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 Jack Traven's annoying John friend. John Dan Green is Fresh Animations. The Weekend. The Great Commonwealth. Thwickenham. From West. And Zany Boy.